We, we always, as human beings, we put people in boxes. If they're different, we push them away. So I think the story speaks of that deeper side of things. Kama leo jamii ni kuna niona kwamba mimi si binadamu na huzunika na tafuta solution. So my film is called In the Shadow of the Sun. It follows um, two albino men uh, as they follow their dreams in the face of severe prejudice, um, isolation and brutal witchcraft fueled murder uh, in Tanzania over a six year period. Making this film over eight years has become much more than a film to me and a huge, huge part of my life. So myself and Joseph Fat, the lead character in the film, have now established a charity. And through screening the film around the world, we've raised a staggering amount of funds for the work we're now doing in Tanzania. Mimi sio shetan, kwenu, jamani, msituwe, tutunzeni. Screened at over 50 film festivals in 42 countries around the world. We're about to launch the film in Tanzania in May, and the Prime Minister will launch the film. And then it will begin, begin an eight month tour around Tanzania into remote regions. So we're taking the film, we're taking screens into the bush to engage with communities. And we have a big outreach team attached to that tour. I'd worked as a cinematographer for 10 years. Uh, this is my first feature documentary as a director. Ultimately, yes, this is a sad story. But I, what I knew is I wanted to find two very inspirational characters. Um, because we see so many sad stories and negative stories coming out of Africa. So I ultimately wanted to show a sort of uplifting story. So I, uh, that's why I ended up following it over the, the next six years. <laughs> 